Yeah. <laughs> I remember this. This is uh, marketing material from Skahoy. The idea was, as it says, video production with a volunteer staff shouldn't be rocket science unless it is this simple. The idea is that Skahoy is in the business of creating controllers that hits the nail right on the head with only the functionality you need and all the complexity taken away. This is one of the early Skahoy controllers, but it's actually a favorite. We really like designing this super simple controller. It's, it's communicating so clearly with a cut and an auto button and six input sources. So it's, it's really great for simple productions. It still has the iconic T-bar as well. So it just had everything that you could dream of. This guy is heavily involved with Blackmagic design technology. With the Ethernet, we essentially developed a way where you can send Ethernet, I think UDP commands, to this port and it will be integrated on the output. This product is old, but we still sell it. It's still useful and it is still the way we suggest that our universal controllers having Ethernet ports will be able to control Blackmagic design cameras. Skahoy started with switching controllers with the Atom series from Blackmagic Design and we did a lot in that direction. One day from the market around us, actually I think it was a partner company, they came to us and asked, could you make an RCP for the Blackmagic Micro Studio camera? They needed the RCP to control it to make a complete solution. We worked with them, we make, made some drawings and Finally, we committed to making the product. With all the partnerships Skahoy is a part of, where we are supplementing with our controllers to create more value for their customers. So that's a very important way that we are innovating and moving this business forward. This is ATEM Television Studio, one of the first versions of the Blackmagic ATEM switches. I gotta admit, this started our business. Skahoy came to be around the time where Blackmagic Design released their series of ATEM switches, which essentially have revolutionized video switching. Back in this time, I was working at a university who needed to do lecture capture. And one of the ways we could do this efficiently was to have a live switching going on in the auditoriums so we could combine multiple PTC camera sources and a computer source with a video switch. And this made it possible. And that's also where Skahoy started its technological ideas because the idea of having controllers that were also targeted to a specific audience like a student helper in need of a few buttons but not more to select the right input sources in the ATEM switch. This is where the whole story started of this company. This is the stupid hat. We need to be able to wear this hat and challenge each other if this is really easy enough for our end users, our customers to understand. We are passionate about inventing the future and the future cannot be one that is too complex. We see a world with more complexity. We are trying to reduce complexity in broadcast live productions, but it only matters if the guy wearing the stupid hat is happy at the end. The guy with the simple questions. So we need to hit that. It's so difficult to merge those two things, but we are dedicated to do it. Thank you.